Hi everyone, my name is Annie Gonzalez and this is going to be a tutorial on how to wear your purple lips like summer, very summer, spring kind of look and add a little bit of color like I have here at the bottom but I have a little bit of turquoise um, so I hope you like it. I'm in love with it and I'm sure you guys will too as soon as you start using it so stay tuned for more of this video if you like it. So I'm going to start off with the Beale Mineral Primer from Hourglass and as you know we're going to use it in the T-Zone and also in the cheeks. And of course as you know primer is going to let your makeup stay forever. Then I'm going to use this palette from Sonia Kashuk which I bought at Target and it's really good. And I'm going to use an angle fluff brush from BH Cosmetics and I'll put all the details below so you can Find this. It was gonna tap all that um, orangey kind of color from Sonia Kashuk and you're gonna put it in your lid. Then I'm gonna use Sova from my favorite palette from MAC and I'm gonna use it with a tapper blending brush from Sigma. I'm gonna put this on the crease and then I'm gonna use the third on the left on the bottom and I'm gonna use a blending brush to stick this color at the end of the corner of the eye. And this is what it's gonna make it look like a little bit of eyeshadow, but not too hard. Then I'm gonna use a, from Urban Decay Naked, I'm gonna use Booty Call with this Tapper Highlighter from Sigma as well to put it in that inner corner of the eye. This is gonna look so good in the inner corner. It's gonna make it look a little bit bright, but not too bright. And it's gonna make your eye look shine. Now I'm gonna use Brown Script from MAC with this special edition brush and I'm gonna put it in that same crease we were put in the base but this is just gonna be a little softer just grab the brush at the bottom of the brush instead of holding it too tight then you're gonna put much more amount of eyeshadow that you don't want then I'm gonna use this Urban Decay electric color I'm gonna use the French color it's an electric turquoise kind of color I'm gonna use bottom eyeliner not on the uh, inside of the liner it's on the bottom where your lashes where your bottom lashes are then I'm gonna use this Revlon color stay eyeliner which is just gonna be a little base for um, to put the eyelashes that's what I usually do because it's easier for me and especially if you don't know how to do your eyelashes so good this will help a lot and then I'm just gonna put the eyelashes whichever eyelashes work for you. So right now I'm gonna apply my foundation. This NARS is the Sheer Glow Foundation in medium one. I'm gonna apply it with a flat Kabuki F80 from Sigma. As you know, I'm gonna put a link below so you can know all the details of the brushes you need to use. Then I'm gonna use a MAC Pro Longer Concealer and this is gonna be in NW15. That's I use it as a highlighter and I used a Tapper Kabuki in F86. And definitely, I love this applying because you can use it in your nose. You can use it in the inner corners or outer corners. And even to contour, it's going to help a lot. To set the foundation, I'm going to set it up with a powder from Sephora. And I'm going to use a dual fiber blush uh, brush from Sigma. You can apply it in all around your face. To set that highlighter, I'm gonna use the Mineral Beal Powder from Maybelline, and this is gonna definitely set that concealer from MAC. And of course, the Brow Wiz from Anastasia Burberry Hills. I am in love with this because this from one side you have the eyeliner, and from the other side you have a little brush that can brush your eyebrow. I also use the Powder Duo from Anastasia for my brows in medium brown. And I usually use the darker color in the outer side of my eyebrows and then the lighter color in the, cor in the inner corners just to make it a little more natural. You can actually mix it if you want, but it's all depending on how you like your eyebrows. Um, what I usually do after putting a little bit of that powder is I brush them again just to see all the little details that are left. Of course, in love with my Hoola bronzer, which I love, 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 and of course, I'm almost done. And I use my fan brush. Just apply it in the cheekbone, both sides, and then on top of your forehead and in between your nose. I'm gonna use a blush palette from BH Cosmetics, and 
I usually mix almost all the colors. I usually apply the darkest color almost at the end, but not too much, like probably at the middle. And then the lightest color, maybe a pinkish kind of thing. And those cheekbones that whenever you smile, they're going to pop out. Then I'm going to use the highlighter from Sephora with a tapered highlighter. The, this time the bigger one. And I'm going to put it on top of that cheekbone, wherever you put the bronzer. You could also put a little bit in your nose just to give it a little glow. And this is how it's going to look. I just love it. For my lips, I'm going to use uh, the Maybelline 420 Blast Full Berry Color. Then I'm going to use the Too Faced Melted in Violet, which is a purple. And I'm going to apply it on top of that other wine kind of color. And this is going to make it look awesome and lovely and that's it that's all you need to know if you like it please 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 subscribe and this is the final look thanks for watching